Hello guys, welcome to another episode of Let's Mod Minecraft, this is episode 3 and uh, today I will show you some of the things I've been making lately uh, Currently uh, I have been working a little of some tasks on this animal, as you can see it's uh, behaving very funny like the head is following the player and stuff if you're close enough by it, but if you go away it will not It's uh, very interested in the item I hold by the way, and carrots, I like both But um this animal here has been uh, made so it can uh, eat grass from the ground if it's on a grass block or around it. Well, sometimes, oh, it's dancing. <laughs> it can see me. Uh, and sometimes uh, this uh, turtle here, it will uh, take a dive in the water. Whoop! Now it wanted to do so. It pushed the other one in. <laughs> so. It has gotten quite some life, uh, there you see it uh, eats some grass, and it has been quite... Uh, I feel I feel it really got some character now, but uh, it was just a starting project to see how the tasks actually works, and there will be a lot of more, much more tasks uh, to research for me. Well, I will have to research uh, about tasks a lot more in the future also, because that's actually some of the last things I'm needing before I will be releasing the mod. Also right now in 1.53 these are not breedable but I will make them breedable soon enough. Um, I've just been focusing on a lot of stuff. Well well let me uh, show you I actually made uh, some eggs and stuff so I'll just start out by showing you the different animals the are in the game once more. Uh, we got the ammonite here, we got the Adam we got the Dunkleosteus, I might have to work a little more on its animation, but I will see into that. And I got the Ichiosaurus here. Um, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna work on making some tasks for them, also I will need to make some animations for them, because right now they're all using the Adam animation and behavior. So they will just go up in the top here right now, but that's how they are coded, because I did not get there yet. Um, then I have made uh, some drops for the ammonite, uh, one of them is the shell. Uh, and I hope in the future actually that people will be able to put this one on their head. <laughs> because there was actually a model, uh, in that model editor I used for this, that actually helped you do that. So. <laughs> It could actually be possible to pick uh, this uh, ammonite shell on the head of you. Now I've made this, I have made some raw tentacle. I think every mod needs some food so you can eat. And I have then made this one. Um, and uh, I have three versions of this food. Uh, I want it raw, I want it cooked and I want it rotten. And then I'm planning to, every animal has uh, this food, uh, those kinds of food, but then when you eat this one, this would be the rotten version. You get some kind of uh, drunkness that only uh, admin users should be able to use, uh, but also if you are doing it right, like you are having healing potion as you do it, you can do it in survival as well. But then I want uh, every animal to have different effect if their meat is rotten. So that's a little <laughs> funny part of it. <laughs> so just so it's not that boring, I will see what there is of, of effects that would be worth trying. But I'm pretty sure you will die pretty fast from this if you do it in survival. We can try it out. Okay, mode, uh, survival, let go. Okay, let's see how fast we'll dive on this. Hmm. It's actually not that bad. Oh, it is actually pretty bad. It is actually very bad. Oh no. Well, well. You will have to uh, find a way to survive that. I guess you guys knows how know how to do that. Uh, there must be a way. So, but else it's just the admin pleasure of playing the game. But that's uh, some of the stuff I'm going Also, um, I had a lot of questions about uh, if I was gonna make this uh, mod for Pocket Edition. Uh, and I have to say, I'm not very familiar with the Pocket Edition of Minecraft yet. Um, I have made it in Forge and I have made the mod in, um, in Java. 
Uh, so there might be a chance that I can just uh, some easy way export it the other way to a pocket version, but right now I'm not really sure. I have never used that uh, version of Minecraft before, so we will see what will happen in the future. Um, yeah, I think that's it for now. Thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe. Have a nice day.